In this video, I'll quickly put you through on how to create to-do list on iPhone. Let's just get right into it. Just get to your Reminders app, okay? It comes pre-installed on every iPhone, so tap on it. As it opens, you will find you see an interface that looks like this. So tap on Add List. Then on tapping on this Add List, you are expected to give this list a name. So let me call this in the list name section. I'll call it activities for the day. Okay, I've finished typing the name activities for today. All right, so let's say that I'm done with everything I want to do here, but I have not listed it. Tap on done. Now, once you tap on done, you will have a new interface that looks like this. Okay, you can see it activities for today. Tap under that title, all right, and start listing. Okay, let's say the first one on my list should be cooking food, okay? Food. Then after typing the first item that you want to complete, first task you want to complete, press tap on the return key, okay, to jump to the next line. All right, let's say I want to wash clothes, okay? Let's say wash clothes. That's the second activity I want to complete for today. Then after that, tap on return, depending on the number of things you want to do for that particular day. So the next one I want to do is my assignment. My assignment. That's the list number three. So I want to do another thing. I want to create content today. So tap on return. I'll tap on return again to say another thing I want to do. I say create videos okay maybe videos for my youtube channel all right so on the assumption that i'm done with all the activities i want to complete for today tap on done now on tapping on done this is saved you can go back okay and i'm here so i can swipe up to get to the home so let's say that now i'm done with the first task and i want to go and check it that i'm done with it so what you need to do is to tap on the Reminders app again. Then as it opens, you find the first on that list, my list, you have Reminders and you have Activities for Today. So tap on that Activities for Today. Okay, I'm done with cooking food right now. So I will tap on the check box, okay? I will tap on that check box for that one to go, meaning that I'm done with that. So I will tap there. And this has gone. So once you tap, they just give it few seconds, maybe three seconds or two seconds. It will go. You can do what? Close the page again. Okay? Maybe this is after two hours. I'm done with the second task for the day. I will then do what? Tap on the reminders again. Once you get to the reminders, maybe you will be find yourself here in the, on this page. Tap on activities for the day. Or the title you give to that reminder, uh, to that um task okay then tap there and then now i'm done with the second one which is watch close i'll tap on that checkbox carefully and it is gone i'll get back to the list so this is how you keep doing it until you complete all the tasks you want to do for that day and then all the list all the contents of the list will be erased I believe this content helps. Please, if it does help, consider subscribing to this channel. Here we cover a lot on technology so that you learn how to complete some tasks in the world of tech. So subscribe to learn more. Leave a comment in the comment section and hit the like button so that YouTube will push this video to more people. Okay? You can check out this video here to learn how to use Safari web browser in detail for iPhone users. Thank you and see you some other time.